Yo, what is gaming, guys? Look at this. Golden shovel. We get to strike gold. It is a high value mega version of we need to go deeper. Whenever you use it, also the charge is insanely high. You dig into the ground and strike literal gold. You bring out a couple golden chests and maybe some pickups as well. Look at this golden heart. And now it probably makes sense as to why I want to play Kane. Boom, boom. We got the paperclip, baby. So that's what we're going to be doing today. We're just going to be going along, using the golden shovel as much as possible and seeing what we can get out of it. This is part of the Milkshake mod that came out recently. A huge mod pack that seems super duper cool with a bunch of different items that I want to check out. First one being this. We also get sticky bombs for our treasure room. Kind of mid, but you know, the bombs are useful, I suppose. It does also have an extra effect, just like We Need to Go Deeper, where with We Need to Go Deeper, you can create purposeful crawl spaces, maybe get a black market. Every single time you do the same thing with the golden shovel, you actually get a member card shop. You know, the, the really good shop ones. What the hell is this? I... What? Oh my god. There's also new enemies. <laughs> it's a it's a really sick mod pack, actually. Whoa, that's awesome. I just gotta blow you up, I guess. Okay, and then uh, probably... Oh, I see. Their creep is uh, permanent. Oh no, no, no. It just lasts a long time. Okay. So I can get out of here without taking any damage. Noise. Anything in the shop, we got a reverse card. I do want extra money, because as I mentioned earlier, we will be getting a lot of member card shops. Uh, and 4.5 volt would be interesting with this. It would be really sick later on, maybe dark room chest. Oh yeah, totally. Also, wow, look at that. The coins look different as well. I like it. It's got a little spray animation to it. That's sick. Yeah. Oh, but never mind. That is not a dime. I don't know what that was. <laughs> I thought it was a dime, but I got baited. That's just a new coin, I guess, but I don't know what it does. Give me the 4.5 volt. Can't get the reverse card, but maybe we'll get more money in the future. As far as I know, with this mod pack, there's obviously new enemies, new items, and new coins. I don't know much about it, but I'm still looking into all of this stuff. It seems like a very expansive pack, uh, and one that we've been waiting for for a hot minute, so this is super cool. Anyway, just gonna be spamming the golden shovel as much as possible, using my paperclip trinket that Kane starts with to just open every single one of them. Probably get a bunch of free items and live on my life. How about we try and make it a goal to clear out the golden chest pool as much as possible? I don't think it's ever possible to do like naturally, but you know, we'll try our best. And we also get a famine fight for a uh, simple cube of meat or ball of bandages. This is whatever. I actually don't know if doing bomb damage contributes a 4.5 volt. It does, but barely. Don't ever do it, guys. <laughs> the cost of health to charge ratio was insane. I got like nothing out of that. I'm not even gonna get a second charge for this floor. That's all right. I'll take the ball. I no way I'm guessing the secret room here. Are you kidding me? Look at that thing. That's nuts. Instead, I'll go down for it. And this next floor is going to be pretty big for us. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a second. There's that reverse card that I kind of wanted to check out. I shouldn't do this, dude. Oh my god. Now there's an enemy in here and I get a full charge. Not yeah. even close to being the case. But then I pay you out because I got paperclip anyway. Boom. Hello? More money? Okay. Another one? Oh. Okay. It's seemingly uh, more worth it. Uh, you've taken everything from me. Okay, that's it. I'm gonna blow you up. We got a one makes you small. Appreciate that. Uh, Endless Nameless would be so cool, but the paperclip is gonna be essential for my plan here. Now we are genuinely good to go to the next floor. Okay, on this floor, we're gonna be accessing every single member card shop possible, I think. Highest priority. As long as we got money, we should be doing it. Okay, it's charged. Let's not waste any charge. There you go. What a sick animation, too. That was, like, very satisfying to do. The more enemies, the better. We'll get more charges. What is in this one? Uh, Pulse Worm and Demon Baby. I don't really know how these work. I'm assuming that even if we were to get the member card shop item, it would be the same thing. Similar how all crawl spaces work. Doesn't matter how many crawl spaces you have, they all leave to the same place. But I could be wrong. Reverse card again, man. Uh, sure? Ooh! Oh, god, that was so worth it! Okay, sick. Should I do it again? <laughs> no way. What, 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 what? That's- I really have two? You're joking. I, I thought I like mixed myself up. No, I really have two. All right, well, there you go. And so this is how you break the game, guys. I don't have enough items to even take advantage of these things. I'm gonna have to do it on the treasure room. Can I go inside the devil bros? I feel like I must. I mean, how else am I gonna take advantage of judgment? I guess I could go crazy, do it in the treasure room, but that's just, I mean, that's not worth it. When I have access to a high value pool of items with a reverse judgment, I'm not gonna waste it on a treasure room, dude. I gotta go for more. Also, downpour two will be a big floor for us, featuring a mirror dimension. So we're gonna have a ton more enemies to farm more golden shovel plays. Cause uh, as of current, the one thing I need more than anything is actually some form of DPS. I'm doing well for myself, but I actually still have basically base statistics here. 
So let's go for the devil play instead. This boss, though, is coming in clutch. It's gonna be the reason that we almost get another charge. Maybe a Krampus fight, we fill it out. We get Constellation Prize. This is a tears up for us. Exactly what we need. And the devil room has good stuff. Hold on. Ocular Rift is large, but I, I gotta roll, dude. I got the money. I have to take advantage. Judas, no. Maybe I should have taken Guppy's head there. Ugh. Oh well. I'll take this. Anything else? Death list. My shadow is huge. Not big enough. Oh, I didn't even see. But I, I think I'm good. I think that was still a good roll because contract is huge. And then we can uh, kind of die but not die on the pack. We'll go check out the treasure room. Probably take the blind. If the left one is not good, take the other judgment and go. This is looking massive. Hello. Definitely not taking the left one. Yoinkage, a little chest, that's nice. I think these are called spirit orbs. A new pickup. I think there's a lot of items that give you spirit orbs. I don't know what they do. This is Spirit of Deluge. For 8 seconds, Isaac's tears are replaced with a controllable waterfall cyclone. It sucks in enemies and pickups. Sure, that sounds awesome. I will um, simply just... Wow, I totally forgot that the member card shop isn't in here. I haven't been in here. <laughs> I thought I was. It's, it's right here. I'm not used to that at all. Uh, we'll just take this reverse judgment as well. Oh, wait, I won't be able to take the- Okay, I'll, I'll use this just to see what it looks like. Oh, oh, it's harsh laser, and I can control it. That's awesome! What? I just broke something open at the keeper. All right, well, we learned a hella from that. We learned what that does. We learned how to control it. And we also learned that it just takes care of keepers for free. Looking like an incredible mod right now. Super duper base. Let's go next floor. Reverse Judgment, another one still in my hands. Gotta figure out what we want to do with this one. Or I'm really interested in is another one of these. This, uh, it's okay, you know. I mean, this is on sale, that's pretty cool. I'm more interested in the, the conjoined, I guess, but even then it's like, yeah, you know. It's whatever. Also, not exactly the most <laughs> health ever. I do have to be a bit careful. I can't just go willy-nilly. Shoving my face into enemies. Gotta reel it back a little bit. My god, contract from below. Clutching it out for you, boy. Who do you think you are? I got contract from below on my side. Hello? What is this? Cool looking beggar room. And this is spirit of virulence. Virulence, sorry. There's a toxic orb that explodes into a damaging poison cloud. They take damage over time. It grows larger the more damage it deals and transforms parts and beggars into their rotten variants. I see the setup here. This probably gives me a bridge, yeah? And then we Spirit shuck this, I guess. Here. Well, I, was, I apologize for not knowing the- <laughs> I didn't know the arc, okay? I was thinking more like an Ipecac. I got one of them though. Not like it matters. I don't even have red hearts. That sucks because I really wanted to play this uh, secret room beggar. Nah, it's a rotten dude. I don't even know if it's gonna happen. I'll come back. Maybe it's uh, more money. We got a chariot card, I'll walk in here and gain some hearts. A small play, but it matters. Currently scouting out the secret room, looks like we have a very lucky one. I'm incorrect. <laughs> I do not, I don't even know where this thing is. This is such a weird one. It's gonna be, okay, yeah, it's right here. Well, we blew up a guy. Malicious murder indeed. How about we just go fight the boss? My golden shovel will recharge mid boss fight. I'll just use it to get some golden chests and consumables, you know what I mean? There we go, there's one. Golden pickups! Rewarded me with golden bombs. That's huge. It literally changes the entire course of this floor. This is massive. Paperclip coming in clutch right there. Let's take the sty. Don't accidentally go to the next floor. I did go down here, didn't I? Yeah, it was Seraphim that I wanted. Sure. Uh, and then I. Ah, uh, it's so sure. Why not? I have the exact amount. It felt like it was destiny. We can go in here. Oh. I don't even know what that is. What is it? It's, it's a literal milkshake. Dude, I guys, I love milkshakes so goddamn much. They're my favorite food. And don't tell me they're not food. I don't care. They are. Soul heart, black heart, or health up randomly. And it's a multiplier to every stat. <laughs> Holy moly. The other item is really good as well. There you go. You can even see the stat multipliers. Wow. What a god item. Jesus. I will be taking that very happily. Thank you. Let's go to the mirror dimension and farm a bit more. We are seeing a lot of new items. This is really sick, actually. I don't even know if you saw our boss. No, it was Midman. I definitely fought you. Sorry, I just, you know, destroyed you so incredibly fast. I just forgot who I even fought. Nice toothpicks. That should go even higher because of my multiplier that I now have. And 11 cents, man. This is just not enough for a rotten beggar. However, I will be doing it. <laughs> I refuse to succumb and become a part of the 99%. I'm- never mind, who even the hell cares what I'm gonna say? Just give me five cents and then you just win, okay? Never mind. <laughs> just give me a freebie, why don't you? Appreciate it. Flip a dip. 
We don't really need flip and dip, do we? Oh, I'm sorry. Do I not have money? <laughs> oh, oh no. Okay, so this is gonna sound crazy. And you're gonna think I'm stupid. But I genuinely thought that once I spawned the restock machine, I control it with my mind. <laughs> Like full on X Men, like wheelchair activity. I'm I'm holding up my hand to my head, and I'm just like, yep, restock that one. No, that I don't want that. We're gonna restock that one instead. Uh, I, I don't see a way to recover from this. So we're just gonna find another secret room item. That'll be easy. Don't worry, guys. I do it all the time. Flooded caves too with the vapor wave filter on. What's good? Golden shovel paying out a bunch already, and we have a ton of batteries spawning for some reason, which is working out immensely for us. Uh, yeah, let's go and here. I'm down to do it. Rerolls all the pickups on the floor if you didn't know. So we're gonna spawn as many pickups as we can and anything that seems fairly useless that was the most disappointing room ever. <laughs> you know what's insane? I never get this bomb ever because usually I just come from the right and I just hold shoot so fast that I, I blow it up incorrectly. That's one of the first times I've ever gotten the bomb. Got a wrath fight right here. I'm basically just trying to get as much cash dosh as possible. I'm on my TikTok grind set. Every opportunity I get, I need more money. This is just how we're gonna have to play because we have so many opportunities for us to spend money. And until I get this reverse judgment out of my inventory, I will not rest. I can see the future already. If I don't get this done with and use it in some form of secret room or at least a room that matters, you guys are gonna hand my ass to me. I know it. <laughs> okay whoa what is that tattered page summons a random lamegaton wisp i'm assuming this also applies to what room we're going to so there you go there is a secret room let's go in here and use a tattered page we get a ladder so we didn't get the uh, 25 percent chance for that to proc that's okay and here we get a euthanasia that's massive thank you and oh man what do i want to do here I keep blowing up mushrooms, not panning out, but we got so many pickups, it's okay. I don't know if I have enough money to, like, justify a membership card on here, though. I... I feel like it's a waste if I don't. I got batteries laying around, we'll be okay. Let's spawn it in here. Nice. Just to see, you know, just to see, like, what's going on. It's, it's ass, there's no restock machine, boom, there you go. I have closure, I'm happy. Finally get that coin that I missed earlier, go to the shop with a bunch of cash. Habit Humbling Bundle. This is the break we wanted. This is so massive. And that is the reason we saved up so much money. As we press forward and use the golden shovel more and more and get even more chests, we're gonna get a huge amount of money because of Humbling Bundle. Honestly, even- wow, hello ceremonial. I was gonna say, even with Humbling Bundle, you know, we also have Contract from Below working. It might be time for me to retire the paperclip if I find a better trinket. I could absolutely see it becoming pretty useless. We have just way too many keys coming in. Our stockpile is too much. Our inventory is heavy and we need to sell some stuff. Did you know Gertie's a girl? I don't know why. Does it even matter? I don't think so, but they are. That guy looks like a homie. I got a Pac-Man ghost that's awesome. <laughs> that night dude, I, I, I've i never really taken a close look at that guy. And I have to apologize for something like that. But to me, bro really looked like that dude. I just get dude vibes from the guy, I don't know. Like I'd chill out with him and play Smash or something, you know? Yeah, this is already happening, you see? I can see the future. The keys are already becoming too much. Once I get a better trinket, I'm gonna take it. This is not better. <laughs> it's, um... Uh, you know what? It might just be. Minimal DPS, but it does something more than uh, having keys I don't need. But I'm still curious about this reverse judgment, man. I'm looking for a secret room and an opportunity to use it. Will it be here? No. Okay. You know, maybe I don't even need to worry about it. I think I don't even have to, actually. Big brain plays. We just go to the chest. And for one or use of my golden shovel, instead of getting a memory card, I just spawn two chests in the secret room. Booms. There you go. Pop reverse judgment and you're chilling, no? That's probably what I should be doing. So uh, let's just chill out on it. It's fine. Reverse judgment's time will come. We can rig easily. Wire coat hanger down here. I don't know if I'm max tier it because I have a multiplier on. And so, you know, I don't know what it's supposed to be. Yeah. I'll risk the 23 cents. Okay, definitely max tier rate. <laughs> definitely just gave away 23 cents for no reason. Oh yeah, I'm kind like that. <laughs> Ooh, luck ups. You'd love to see that, dude. 
the more the merrier. Just gonna get so many more pickups. It's really gonna ramp up. Not to mention, I find it really cool. We're gonna be able to get a member card shop every single floor, not just floors with the shops on. And with restock? Okay. <laughs> that's always something that's bothered me about it. I mean, obviously it exists for balanced reasons and it should exist, but it feels kind of meh. Once you beat mom and you know the only time you're gonna get another member card shop is if you somehow beat Hush, you know? But we'll be able to get as many as we want, even on the cathedral or chest or something. We do got a restock here and a spirit of conductivity. Shoots a wave of electricity in all directions, damaging nearby enemies. Short circuits all machines in a radius, causing them to pay out multiple times and explode. Okay, do it then. Cool! That was awesome! Uh, I figure, you know, it doesn't really matter to do that just yet. I can't believe you gave me a birth throw. Uh, you will just use the birth throw on the guaranteed deal that I have. And then we'll save the reverse judgment, as we said, for the chest. HP, I really don't even know how much I have, so this is useful to me. Ooh. Do I sacrifice it all? Here, I think I really do, dude. I think I give it all away and then I perthra what I get. Oh my god! Or I just tank it, man! That's sick! <laughs> I'll take a goat head and ah, I'll take this. Roll that. Sanguine bond. Guppy's collar. We could take Guppy and then buy the trinket, no? That black market had a Guppy trinket, I think. I wasn't really gonna call Guppy being a factor this run, but if that's the way this goes, that'll be cool. I haven't had it in a while. How much were you asking for? Oh, you're hella cheap. Yeah, come here, man. Anything in here? Blue map. Oh, yeah, that's worth, man. Broken modem as well! Okay, broken modem's mega worth. We gotta get Sisk more sense. A nickel and a penny, please. Anything cool in here? This is, uh, it's okay. But I think this is just how I'm gonna get some money, honestly. I didn't realize I had so much health, so I'm just gonna kind of chunk it all. Goodbye. How did I not get a blood bank? <laughs> Let's go. Boom. Let me in here. This one also had nothing, but a bone heart makes me feel a little bit better about chunking all my health away. I'll buy this for future proofing, and uh, I think we have to still find the treasure room on this floor. Then we'll go fight the boss. Another day using my voice for YouTube and then getting a voice crack. <laughs> it's a curse, ladies and gentlemen, I swear. <laughs> oh, hello. What are you selling? Nothing. I could get my conjoined back, I guess. I could reverse judgment. Nah, it's not worth it. Not with what the future probably entails for me. I can't deny that. I have to go for the full secret room play. Bloodshot eyes, okay. At this point, we're just gonna farm golden shovel and uh, probably fight the boss. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is so strong. I really want it. <laughs> I don't really care about Guppy too much, honestly. I'm gonna stick with the Blood Clot. This is gonna be more fun. I probably will end up being able to get Guppy at some point in the run, just because I have Goat Head and it's logical that it would happen. I don't really know where I'm going. <laughs> we gotta take care of you real quick. Use it right away, get as much money as I can. We should still be able to easily get some form of uh, memory card on the next floor. This stayed open, obviously because of Goat Head. Uh, most I would hope for is Guppy, but again, I already gave away the trinket, so at that point, who even really cares? Everything about the Milkshake mod seems so goddamn cool, dude. They even have a bonus minigame for baseball. Everyone needs the bonus baseball minigame. It's the one after the baseball level. Matriarch, hi, goodbye. You have fallen from grace. You are no longer that hard. Especially, Jesus Christ, with broken stopwatch on my team. You serve zero purpose, goodbye. Range up. Okay, I think a range. I'll also take this, spend it on the devil maybe? What is that? That's new! I could trade away my golden shovel for a normal one. Sickle cell. It's piercing when tears cause bleeding, which makes enemies leave creep and damage as they move. That is just pure a damage up. I need it. Oh my god, it's like backstabber, but better. <laughs> What if we made Backstabber, but it procced 100% of the time? What are these member card shops, man? This better be another rever... Hello. Well, do I even really care about that? I mean, yeah, I kind of do. Nah, I kind of don't. <laughs> Reverse Stars does nothing, man. It's literally just me using the Golden Shovel in the chest later on. We get It Lives! Hi! It Lives is just bleeding out. That was brutal. I somehow landed Perfection, which, uh, you know what? I'll take. Why not? Who cares? It's a fun item. 17 luck is so absurd. There's that Guppy I called that would happen. Because why the hell would it not happen? Of course, I'm gonna get Guppy. I got Goathead. But, you know, I couldn't have taken anything anyway. So we're going with my original plan. Let's go to the chest and see what we can do with the secret room instead. Let me in, dude. I'm here to buy. Okay, we finally have a restock machine. What's going on here? Adoption papers? Ah, nah. Magic fingers? Not my vibe. We don't even have bookworm. I don't think that's worth 36 cents. Pentagram? 
Eh, yeah. uh, really? I mean, 40 cents for a damage up? I can go for more. I'd rather keep my money. You know, what if there's a, a 70 cent brimstone? Didn't happen. Coulda, though. Well, vine boom moment. <laughs> there goes the 15 luck perfection that I was rocking. I guess we're going with a golden stud finder instead. I saw two coins here that looked unique. Purple coins. I don't know. What? Okay. It's a cursed penny. I get it. I, told, I get it. I understand. I'm gonna go back to that library and open it and see what's going on. If there's two books in there, I'm gonna be furious because that means I would have unironically gotten bookworm from the book of Revelation. <laughs> Good morning, gamer. I can't believe this. <laughs> Where is the boss? Okay, now I know. Book of Shadows, we get 2-3. Uh, Key Beggar is huge, but it would be huger on the next floor, so I think I'm just gonna go whoop. And that, okay, alright, I I hate this game. <laughs> Large play though, hold on, look at the clutchness, look at all those red hearts, that's gonna be useful. Not. Nah. Didn't I already talk about this? I don't know if I talked about this, I'm getting deja vu. Maybe I talked about this with Luis. I, I mentioned to Luis how I remember back in the day, kids used to say like a, a sentence that was purely non-factual whatsoever, but they just, they said it, I guess. And they would always go back with not. Nah. And I, I don't know why they did that and they don't do that anymore. <laughs> That was like some weird era that if you were there, you knew. That was a literal if you knew, you knew moment. Dude, it just sounds like I'm bludgeoning Isaac's face in. <laughs> Beating that guy to a pole. Let's close out our golden shovel run with a huge secret room play with the reverse judgment. This is what we're waiting for. Everything's been building up to this. We even got a blue map, so we know where we want to go. Dunn's cap, mom's razor, HP. I'll take all this stuff, honestly. I am banking only on this reverse judgment giving me the best secret room items possible. So I'm okay taking these. I got no plans to roll. I got Eucharist and, uh, you know, a, a big old piece of meat. I totally forgot about restock, to be honest with you. So I guess here's a reason I can spend some money. Yay, blood clot. Cool. But don't get too crazy. We need some cash for reverse judgment. Why is Dunscap doing this? Oh, you know why? It's because of the Eye of the Occult. Wow, I didn't know about the synergy at all. Eye of the Occult and Dunscap is just 2020. <laughs> we got more alchemist guys chemistry moment they kind of destroyed themselves in an epic hack way try and decimate me they have no luck though here we go we're finally at the secret room come in here my goodness it's poetic the amount of things that are happening make sure it's not a special crawl space i just want to dig some chests thank you open open honestly i'm low-key tempted to take use mascara <laughs> we don't even have to reverse judgment right now we can get more golden shovel actually so let's just save it for the very end maybe we'll get something good big chub and some bombs thank you what what are you? Converts all bomb key and most coin pickups into rainbow pennies. What's a rainbow penny? Rainbow pennies activate the effect of the corresponding penny trinkets on pickup. Well, that just answered my question. Wait, so if I take this and I go all the way back here. Uh, wait, wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, it's a passive? I thought it was like active because it says you turn things into... Oh, okay. Uh, maybe we'll see it happen. I don't know. That's cool though. I want to know what a rainbow penny does. Check, check. Lacrophage is the easy choice here. What are you? It, it looked like a new boss to me. I understand that that was literally just Mama Gertie, but with new enemies, but I swear, like, I was fighting Mother or something. Like, I, I saw the future. Boom, more chests, only one this time. We open it to Gish. I think we can farm a bit more, at least maybe one more. Whoa, are those rainbow pennies? What is happening here? There's too many pennies. There's this guy. I imagine that's a health penny. This is a charged penny, I can only imagine. And what, like fart cloud penny? Uh, pill penny. Oh, cool. I like pill penny. That's a cool idea. I, why do I have so many tears? This is so awesome. What is this? Golden, golden penny? Who even knows? This is definitely bomb penny. That is penny penny. <laughs> I got an extra one cent from that. That's huge. I'm going in my bag roll. Another one. Nice. There you go, Satanic. Hello. I'll use you for a bit of safety. And I finally get my book room, so I feel redeemed. What is that? Spirit of Salvation. Shoots eight damaging beams of light in all directions. Beams can destroy rocks and open secret rooms. Let's use it in this room. Spirit of Salvation. Oh, they got custom. Oh, I messed it up entirely. <laughs> Mob transformation from here. That's cool. Don't forget the reverse judgment. All right. Well, at least I know how that works. It's basically revelation, but in eight directions, like the uh, dogma fight. Uh, what is this? Flat penny? I guess keys? Okay, that makes sense. Looks like there's a penny for every single pickup and just extra ones in general. Milkshake mod is so nuts, man. That's just sick. We got another one rotten penny with fate's reward. Okay, this is probably going to be our last one. We're going to have to reverse judgment now, I think. 
Oh, yeah, because this is the boss. Okay, well, let's do the dude then. Let's get overpowered. Can't go a single Matman video without a little bit of a smart rig, you know what I mean? We gotta expand the knowledge. Here we go. Rolling time. There you go. The infinity. We can put down the golden shovel for good now. This is new? What are you? Empty slot inserts a coin after 10 coins has a 1% chance to explode and double the coins inserted. Guaranteed to explode at 100 coins inserted. Oh, that's cool. You just keep putting money into it and eventually pays out. Mongo gambler. That's, that's I really like that actually. Uh, roll this. We get some items. Uh, nothing too crazy. I guess we got a soul heart. Don't want to risk the eternal d6. There's just no reason to like delete any items. Uh, that's new. Wow. We're seeing so many new things. This is mirror key. I guess maybe like a red key kind of thing. Once a room can create a mirror dimension door on the wall. What? I gotta check this out. Indicated by the door outline. Mirrored rooms regenerate all pickups, obstacles, and enemies. Item pedestals are not regenerated though. Allows refining the floor boss for an extra reward. That is cool. I love that. I gotta check that out later. That's oh! all. Alright, well, you know, those are still just the classics. <laughs> you just give me the classics. Everything will be okay. Yeah, there you go. That's those are the big things. I'll take a DC into a brim because I feel like it. Or rolls, we get a spin down die. That would be kind of cool, I think. Spin it down. This is an extra roll. Diplopy. <laughs> sure, why not? Double all this up. I'll get 2020 in Sacred Orb for no reason. 2020, Sacred Orb, lock in. There's another spin down, so I get another roll. Donate a bit more. I don't even know, guys. You guys are gonna have to go back. Cause what the hell did I just get? <laughs> I'm unsure. I like danced for two seconds and I decided to not get boogie down with it. I got a little bit of stage fright, I guess. Come on, Isaac. You gotta own the stage, dude. You just gotta commit, man. What is that? Polyphemus moment. <laughs> yeah, that's the good stuff. And that will be it. I can't believe what weirdo run we decided to come up with. What is this? But I am glad we rigged it. Dude, I didn't even use the reverse judgment. What the hell? I got everything I wanted. Like, I wanted Continuum. I wanted Polly. I wanted Cricket's head. <laughs> Here, I'm, I'm gonna roll you. Yeah, you know what? Parasite, sure. What a wild day. What the hell happened, dude? <laughs> I can't believe it. Dude, Milkshake mod was so cool. And we've barely scratched the surface. I killed that guy within two seconds. I'm excited to check out the rest of it. And honestly, guys, GG.